he built this instrument so he could continue research that started with Carl Jansky, who was using an antenna identical to the one that's across the street on your right. Jansky was trying to figure out what might cause interference over a transatlantic phone line when he accidentally discovered natural radio signals, but his employer, Bell Laboratories, did not see a value in studying a natural signal, so he went on to other projects. And no one followed up to confirm his discovery until Greg Reber did so several years later. This so you is building across the street on your right is the cafeteria for our employees. We also have a residence hall there for visiting scientists. The second building on the right is our bunkhouse for school groups. We can accommodate 60 students overnight. The Jansky lab is on our left where the receivers are designed and built. We also have remote control rooms for the telescopes and office space in the building. You're going to notice these flagpoles and markers as we travel along the site road. This is a distance scale model of our solar system. The scale is one to three billion. I think, are they up on top of those posts? <laughs> so we're taking a tour of all these satellite dishes, these radio We are going to stop at the observation deck. This is a, well, normally it's a good place to get a photo. It's a little foggy. So it's not the greatest photo opportunity today. But if you'd like to get off the bus here and take a picture, you're welcome to. Would you like to get off? Sure. Mm. You could drive back down this far too. So this is the Green Bank Telescope. Kind of hidden in the clouds. The whole dish refracts the rays and it hits that tiny dot it's held up on the held up above. No. Thank you. So the one you were looking at is this is the big one, right? That is it. Yes. head on down the site we are going to go through a set of gates the gates are here to prevent random traffic through the telescope area many things cause interference including spark plugs and gasoline powered vehicles so only authorized diesel vehicles are permitted the visitors are welcome to walk around the site and ride bikes around the site anytime once we go through the gated area you do need to have all your electronics turned off That's because it gives interference to the radio signal. So this is a radio quiet zone around Green Bank. Actually it goes all the way to Roanoke and Staunton and up to Charlottesville or Charlottesville. Anyway, so I guess I gotta turn it off now. Goodbye. <laughs>